Okay, my name is Nanko. I'm with the Power Chief Semiconductor uh, Corporation. In short, we call ourselves ESMC. Actually, in the shortest time, actually, we got have three major products I would like to introduce to, 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 to our audience here. And, and that's uh, uh, different wafers you show okay. here. Okay, the first one here is called the, the processor. So that's that's been a very up country actually. Most of the GPU or GPU they require very big uh, the subject to accommodate uh, the GPU and HP together. So right now we can do in processor the size in the processor can up to 3.1x depending on size. That's mean that we can put GPU and also a piece of the HP on the same subject. So we right now we can do this kind of big size or radio size. That's a very typical requirement for this kind of GPU, especially at the very GPU product. Okay. So do you talk about you said GPU, the GPU, and other parts? Other the, uh, and then also this is only in the processor for GPU. So the GPU will on the top of the processor. Okay. And uh, what you need point for all the processor is that uh, in all in the processor we have the embedded capacitor. So that's been that's very important because you know right now. For high speed signal, you, you need to cancel the noise. So we use the uh, embedded capacitor to, 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 to cancel or to filter the noise. That's very important for this kind of GPU application because typically this kind of very require very high, high speed signal and also you need a very stable power. So this kind of embedded capacitor will do a lot of help for this kind of applications. Okay? And so the, is it a special way to create the GPUs? Huh? This is why not a GPU. This is the processor, but use you you use for the uh, it's used by the GPU because in the processor is just like the substrate. Okay, so you can put the GPU on the top in the processor. Okay, and in order to connect with other components such as HPN. Okay, so that that's mean that it's very uh, if you want to have uh, this kind of product to provide a uh, very high speed and also low power communication mechanism. Our solution in the process can provide this kind of way of solution. It sounds like some of the new tricks that your company is doing and with partners and everything is put stuff on top of each other to connect them faster and everything. Yes, you, you are. You right. align the different wa wafers or you put several layers. Yes, you are right. You are right. You are right. And this one actually is another uh, the, the major focus of our demonstration here on this show this time. This one is also we put a piece of the wafer. What well, eight pieces of ether together into one compressed it into one wafer. So we can show this this slide here. So we have the eight piece of wafer, given wafer into make it into stacking it together. So that's been that uh, for the wafer they can closely connect with the, 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 the larger chip very closely. They can provide very big uh, bandwidth and also capacity. So you can check and tell from this charge here. Okay, if you watch out have one layer, there will has only one uh, bandwidth and also one capacity. But if you put the uh, piece of the, the, the layer together, so that means that you have eight times the capacity, capacity and also eight times of the bandwidth. Here. Is it like 3D memory? Or what is sure. this? You are right, you are right. But it's not 3D NAND, it's 3D DRAM? 3D memory. 3D memory. Because we just used the DRAM stacking with each other. Uh, we, we become the 3D memory, 3D DRAM, uh, provide a huge capacity and a huge bandwidth. Yes. That's really cool. Let's walk around here. Okay. And also uh, this one. Okay. This one, I just try to show, demonstrate that uh, uh, as, a, uh, as a poetry group, actually, we have many subsidiary. Some are then focused on the logic design, some are focused on the, the DRAM design. This one is all to show that actually, in the poetry group, we can do the logic wafer, and also the DRAM wafer, and the logic design and the DRAM design as well. And also we can bond the two, two kind of wafer together to provide a single chip solution. Single chip solution. Okay. So, so you that, put the ARM MCU yeah, that, that's with that, MPU, that, that's that, the SOC. SOC with And what you put together? DRAM together? And then together, you can, we can stay with the, with the DRAM together. Here we have 128 pick up by DRAM, stay with the ARM CPU. Provide the embedded solution, yes. And everything and the chip there. Yes, you are right. The, the, middle, the, the middle one. The middle one. Yes.
All right, maybe we can go around you both. You, you're illustrating okay. more. What do you talk about on the wall here? Uh, yeah, this one just tried to demo the show that actually uh, as a group, we can provide the whole space for the solution. So not to cover with the dealer design house, we also cover cover with the, 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 the service company, and also also with the offsite because also required the process to provide the high solution or high speed our level packaging solution. We also to uh, cover with the solution provider such as the the the, the OEN, ODN, and the, and the cloud service provider. So cover with them to provide the total solution. What is this 3D integration technologies? You are right. You are right. The show show you all technology. Happy bound, PSV, and multi staking. So we have them together to put them together. So that's what we call the technology in the previous slide. So we can provide the 3D ADI and also we can provide the interposal here and the bridge. And also I mentioned that uh, we are the company that provide the logic, DRAM, and also staking technology. So we put all those three together into, into one product. Is it uh, unique to do eight times DRAM layers? Nobody else can do this? Uh, I will not say that nobody can do that. But we are quite sure because we are the DRAM manufacturer. So we know, we know how to deal with the, the, the DRAM manufacturing. And also, right now we are talking about the hybrid bond. Because the typical staking way that yeah, people are talking about is not using the, the, the micro bond, okay, micro bumping to stake the DRAM together. But right now we are talking about hybrid bond. So it may not be like the, the, the DRAM can, can contact with each other more closely. Yes, so that's a different kind of approach. And if we go over here, um, is it also um, is it also the same what you're talking about here? Yes, you are right. And uh, this one actually it's kind of uh, uh, simple right now. Actually, we have the logic wafer here, and also this is uh, the different wafer. So this so these two are closely to to contact to each other. So we are sticking with each other. So one AI SOC yes. can talk with four DRAM tiles yes, that's on right. one one chip. And one chip, put them together into just just like the multi-tier time. Okay. So this is a broad diagram. So in the SOC here, we have AI engine here, and also we have some on the CPU here. We can refresh five CPU here. Okay. And also because we are making them sticking with each other. So that's been that they can connect to each other very closely, provide very high bandwidth. Because the data pass here is very wide. And wide the database, the data pass here, so you can provide very high bandwidth between the GPU, sorry, the 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 the, 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 the CPU, uh, the, 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 the TPU, SOC. SOC, and also the DRAM. Yes. And, uh, and, uh, and what you, is it the same you talk about there? Yes. This one, just, uh, this one is uh, because right now we can do the eight pieces of wafer thinking together with each other. But this one only shows the, the, the four pieces. Okay, so you, we can put the eight pieces taken even together become the one chip. Okay, and still we can provide very high bandwidth between the memory chip and also the SOC chip. Yes. Nice. <laughs> and here at the booth, you have many partners showing some cool stuff. Uh, what is, for example, this cool thing here? There's like yes, uh, the, 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 with foveated rendering. This is the micro display. Micro display, okay. They can, uh, in they, partnership they, with SEL, maybe. Uh, you, are right, you, you are not that right, like they get you. Uh, here, SEL. And this is a uh, 3.6K by 3.6K with the foveated render rendering okay. on yes. the micro display. 4K micro display. Yes. Because of the 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 the, the, the piece of the, the inch is very high, yeah, the resolution is very high. Nice, it's such a high quality, and uh, this is it. Yes. Nice. I want one of those. So I did another video about this, okay. and here's some some other uh, other things you want to highlight. Something at the because booth. Also, this this part, this part actually is a pavilion. Pavilion. So we invite all partners including the, the memory design house and also large design together to start demonstrate their technology, especially they utilize our technology for their products. Okay. And for example, uh, here is with the partner uh, 
talking about okay. what you showed me before, huh? Okay. So it's in partnership with Centronix. Yeah, Centronix is one of our subsidiary in our poultry group. Okay, one of our subsidiary, okay. And then they provide the dealer design house, the dealer design service. So once you have your larger products, they can provide the service to be a product sticking with our DRA. Okay, so so that's mean that they have this kind of expertise to provide the solution, service solution for a different design house. Because uh, in AI world and in this world, there's so much demand for more performance, faster chips, faster memory, faster memory bandwidth, faster SOCs, and you Correct. want to integrate everything. Yes, you are right. We not, what we not, we not only provide the, 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 the second wave of production. In the, in the poultry group, we also provide this kind of total solution. That's been that uh, for certain kind of brand, you request some kind of IP, and also you would request some kind of design services. In the poultry group, we are subsidiary to provide this kind of service to the customers. And yes. if we walk around here a little bit, and also, some other examples of uh, partnerships, right? Primizer and the Dimento, all So like uh, here's the AI, Dream Transform Core, and you develop, maybe it's there? Yes. Yeah. And, uh, Hi. They so, provide the IP for the AI model, the big model. So that's so right now people are talking about large engine model. They provide the, the a standard IP for the large engine model. Okay. All right. Maybe we can do separate videos in there. And uh, also here's E3. E3. And here's uh, little chips. E3 is also a very important research institute in Taiwan. Okay. What do we see here? And this is a this is their accelerator, MPU accelerator to accelerate it. It's worth, worth this, this one. Right, it's accelerating vision. Yeah, you are right, you are right. Deep learning. Deep learning, yeah, you are right. Mosaic, DRAM, a whole yeah. bunch of integrations yeah, because here. Because just like you see here, you, know, you can put a different kind of combination of DRAM to, 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 to work with your the larger chip. That is the CPU here, MPU. So maybe you just have two CPU core, you just need to put two pieces of DRAM here. So if you got three pieces of different CPU core, you can put another DRAM here. So just like the mosaic, you can have a different kind of first of all, first of all the configuration. Nice. Yes. And if I continue around your booth, yes. right here, uh, let me have a look here. Maybe uh, you have PSMT Japan. Yeah, because I mentioned that actually, uh, Pouch as a group, we provide not only the web of inventory, we also provide the, 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 the design service. Okay, and also PSMT in Japan actually is very like in the DRAM design. So if you talk about this kind of high speed application, we require customized DRAM design, then the other team they can provide this kind of customization of the DRAM design. And and uh, just so I understand, when you when you stack in 3D, is it multiple wafers you stack together, or sure. is it one wafer with many layers? No, not really. We have a multiple wafer. Okay, stay together. Okay, become become a one 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 way. We become this similar to one chip. Okay, and also this second wafer can stack with the larger wafer further. So that means that it can provide very many lots of the tons of uh, maybe thousands of the connection there. So you can provide a very big bandwidth here. Yes. Nice. So it just provides unlimited. I mean, there's a limit, eight maximum right now layers, right? Yeah. You can you consider designing even more? Sure, sure. So because right now, actually, you know that right now the model size become bigger and bigger. You require the, the, the bigger, bigger bandwidth. So right now we are talking about maybe, right now currently we are up to eight, but right now we are talking about maybe even 12 and even more. That you are That's right. amazing. Yes. And if I go over here, mm -hmm. uh, here I see AP memory. What is that about? And is it this a also uh, our part of the nature, they specialize in the high speed DRAM design. Okay, they call it VHM. Okay. Yeah. And it's a so, 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 so very they can nice design for the RAM. solution to our gears thing together, but provide a high bandwidth to the larger chip that's so here. Okay. So actually, how's it connect? How do you connect every layer? 
Uh, the to X get uh, 24 terabyte per second. The, the first thing, that, that, that very good question, actually, the first thing you need to have TSV. The, 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 the TSV need to punch, punch through the, all the wafer, okay? And, 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 then, and then also you need to require the hybrid bond. Because for each wafer, you need to have the same kind of connection there. So you require the hybrid bond to connect the signal from this wafer to another wafer. So you need to have the TSV to punch, it, to punch through each wafer. And the voice wafer, you need to have a hybrid bump head connected to another wafer. Yes. And there's a lot of connectors. The whole chip is connected? Yeah, oh, for sure. How, how many connectors you need? Depends depend on the design. Yeah, depends on the design. But uh, I would say maybe the connection there will be thousands of the connection there. Yeah, depends thousands? On thousands. And, and what is happening here? The Yes, MT There's another, AI another of our the DRAM, DRAM partner, DRAM design partner, is very excited to design this kind of DRAM design for the, the edge of the cage, consumer DRAM cages. So there's a design for the AI PI. They, they have PCBs, they, they, they have some kind of spell design for the, for the, for the, especially for the edge application. Oh, right. applications. Combines 3D DRAM stacking yes. and processing in memory. All right. So there's a lot of cool partnerships that you're working with in your company. Sure, Always sure, new technology, sure. right? Sure, sure, sure. We'll try to demonstrate that like, uh, we are not only manufacturing the way for the sale, we also have a partner and provide a total solution to the customers. Yes.